Welcome back, my friends, to Fallout New Vegas. This is episode 12. Thank you for being here with me today. Um, last we left off, I had just... Ooh. Legion can count on that. Uh, okay. Um, last we left off, I had just finished uh, doing some commerce here. I got myself a little bit of a doctor's bag. Um, I'm hoping that I don't have to use it and that I can speak to a doctor around here to help me patch up my limbs. Um, but we'll see. We're going to do a little bit of exploring in this here mess hall. I'm thinking of some characters we can talk to. Looking for trouble. And I guess at that point, um, we're just heading back to Nipton and then probably beyond, you know? Let's see. I'm just looking around, Miss Lady. Well, keep those eyes up and turning, or I'll set them spinning. Got no time for gawkers, or anyone looking for something I ain't selling. Uh, I think she means to imply that she's not a prostitute. Um, are you alright? How about a drink instead? Surprise, you can see me from that deep in the bottle. <laughs> I was looking for someone worth my time. Jesus. Um, how about just, are you alright? That seems like a nice, innocent way to not get my balls shot off. Alright? No, I'm not alright. Drinking to forget, and it's only getting me mad instead. Been there. Whiskey always gets my temper up now more than ever. Drinking used to cause all sorts of trouble back west. Before I punched enough people, that is. And they learned to lay low when the whiskey hit. Hmm. Um, let's see. Back west. What are you trying to forget? Seems like a dangerous proposition. So does this one. Um, also, as you guys might have been able to tell uh, by now, I installed a UI mod that is hopefully going to make our, um, well, our UI better. It already does. Even, like, the trading menu is much easier to navigate. Yeah, if you couldn't tell, I'm not from around here, and I'm not NCR. I run a caravan. Or did. Lost my caravan heading north. The driver burned to ash. And they didn't even take the cargo. They just burned that too. Oof. Um, yeah, it doesn't sound like raiders. It might have been fiends. They're crazy like that. Why would they do that? Uh, I'm going to go with this one because it makes me my sound smart. Legion. Yep. They're trying to cut NCR supply line. And the Mojave outpost is proof. Got us locked up tighter than a New Vegas virgin. Oof. No caravans in, <laughs> out, and just try arguing with Jackson about it. Roads aren't safe, he says. Well, he's right. No shit, you washed out old yeah. fuck up. I didn't need a brotherhood scribe to tell me that. Yikes. Um, I've met him. Nice impersonation. Who's Jackson? What are you going to do? So you're out of the caravan business. I'm probably going to go with one of these two. Um, what are you going to do, Cass? Drink. Got a lot of memories to drown. If I die while doing it, so be it. Got nowhere else to go. Jackson Yikes. won't let me head north. It's not safe. And even though my caravan's gone, my caravan papers are keeping me here. So if you came here for work, my advice? Go find the Crimson Caravan Branch south of Vegas. They can help you out. Um, okay. Uh, thanks, I guess. See, so I wanted to ask you something What's else. What's on your mind? Uh, why are you here at the bar? Anything you can tell me about the outpost? Any work around here? Cass is drowning her sorrows in the Mojave outpost. Her advice? Go work for the Crimson Caravan. Well... I mean, we know the answer to this one. Any work around here? Never mind, I'll be going, I suppose. You take care now. Thanks, Cass. You're not as prickly as you make yourself out to be, or maybe we just kind of stayed on our good side. Hey, Prim has a new sheriff. That should keep the powder gangers away. Yeah, I'm the one who did that. That seems to be the only thing people want to talk about. Um, any chance... Now, I feel like if there's a doctor around, he's probably going to be back in the main hall. Um, but I do need a nap. Let's see, anyone? Can I sleep here? Sleep bunk bed? Oh, nice. Um, let's say maybe like four hours, five hours. Sleep. That's a nice little nap. I've been up for a while. I actually don't know if that'll do it. Um, how are my limbs doing? Sleep deprivation level has increased. Nice. Now I'm just straight up crippled. Um, whoops, that's not the right button. Fuck me. Hopefully there's a doctor. There's gotta be a doctor around, right? If not, I'm going to have to use that doctor's bag, and I think, if I remember correctly, it only works on um, one limb at a time. Right? The Strip is the heart of New Vegas. Where I'm Okay, alright, see you later. Um, This is the only two spots here, right? Let me just double check that. I'm starting to get used to using the F buttons as a shortcut to the Pip-Boy. Mojave Outpost Headquarters, Mojave Outpost Barracks, that's it. I, oh, that's right, we get paid for, um, killing those critters. I forgot about that. Hopefully there's a doctor in town as well. And then we're gonna fast travel back to Nipton. Do a little bit more 
scavenging. A little Major Knight. Been doing a lot of good work out there, setting an example for the others. I know Ranger Jackson appreciates it. Thank you. Um, I need repairs. Uh, not really at the moment. Um, I also stacked all my food and stuff with EDE. Um, because that way we can carry more stuff ourselves. Although it doesn't matter, I suppose, when it comes down to it. There's Ranger Jackson. Appreciate the help. Wish I had more work for you. But nothing else on the radar at the moment. That's okay, Mr. Jackson. Yeah, you mentioned a reward before. No, I mentioned you might accidentally get supplied, and I meant it. Not allowed to contract mercenaries at the outpost. All right, fair enough. Still, a requisition form or two can get lost, and they're not going to come check. So here you go, just between us. Service rifle, huh? Oh man, and we got armor piercing, two caravan lunches. Hey, I'll take that. Weapon repair kits, doctor's bags, maybe. Damn, that's actually pretty good. Yeah, I know I'm crippled. Uh, I bought a doctor's bag off of the um, the lady, but she was like, that's the only one that she had. And it doesn't look like there's a doctor here. Um, fuck me. Ranger Jackson? Appreciate the help. Yeah, I know, I'm sorry. Alright, I guess that's Take it. Take care. I know I could cool off in the barracks or whatever you just said, but I'm more interested in getting my broken arm and leg fixed. Fuck me. Well, I suppose I could fast travel back up to Good Springs, but that seems way out of my way. Um, and that will take resources in and of itself, I suppose. I'm also quite nervous to fast travel now, <laughs> given that, uh, uh oh. Well, you scared me. Prim is a new sheriff. That should keep the powder gangers away. You don't say. Um. Prim is a new sheriff. Oh, wow. That should keep the powder gangers away. Uh, that's crazy. I feel like I just heard that somewhere. Hey there. Need anything? Uh, I need doctor's bags. Sure, here's... I need... What you got in the way of aid, my friend? Apparel. Oh, he's got a lot of metal armor. I can use that to repair the ones that I got. Um... Mm. Fuck. That's not gonna do it. Um... Alright, well... I say let's use our doctor's bag. Well, alright. First of all, if I'm gonna be going back to Good Springs... I'm gonna save right here. Um... And then we'll fast travel, we'll see how it goes. Last time I tried to fast travel, the game crashed. That wasn't super fun. Um, so let's see here. Good Springs is so far back up this way. It seems like a... Like a... Just strange that we'd be able to just teleport all the way back up there and then head back down, right? So actually, I'm not going to do that. I was fine fast traveling between these two spots. Um, just because they're not super far away from each other. It's just like a time saver. Um, and it doesn't really fit or... Disrupt my personal role play, we'll call it. Um, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna pop in here. I'm gonna go aid. Oh, I got a, a book too, duck and cover. Explosives increased by three. Nice. Um, and then I almost want to wait until we get that other perk um, to use these, but you know, whatever. That's gonna be a while anyway. And if it's just the two books, I suppose that's all right. All right, now doctor's bag. Um, hopefully. Okay, that applied to more than one limb? Alright, nice. Fuck, that seems bad. Um, like we're really gonna have to be careful about getting into combat until we find ourselves a doctor. I suppose it gets the job done for a little while at least. Anyway, we just saved it, right? We did? Alright, I'm gonna save it again. I'm gonna save right over that one. Um, and then we'll teleport back to, uh, Nipton. Save ourselves some time. Nipton. Yes, please. Don't crash. The boomers are said to be xenophobic tribals armed with even more firepower than the gun runners. No one ventures into or out of their heavily guarded lands. That's one way to keep yourself safe, I suppose. Um, alright, well, let's just pick up where we left off. Maybe we'll find ourselves a doctor's bag here in town. What do you guys think? We'll be finding all kinds of stuff. And hopefully this time we won't step on a landmine. Um, oof. Can't go around that way. Um, why don't we start with... Let me get my shotgun back out. Makes me comfortable. There we are. Uh, why don't we start... We checked this house, right? I believe. Let me double check that. Just to make sure. This is where I blew up. Yeah, because I remember we came out of here. That's alright. Oh, no, we, uh, we went in here and then left because we were gonna bring all of our stuff back. Oh, look at all this food. Just gonna eat it all right now. Maize, barrel cactus fruit. 
Give me that banana yucca fruit. Honey mesquite pod. And wow. Quite the uh, spread this person had here. That might as well be like a Thanksgiving feast for a post apocalyptic land. Here we go. Aid. Give me that and that and that. And I got some caravan lunches. That's a really good one. Um, honey mesquite pod. Delicious. Some maize. So hold on to the rest of it for now. I don't like this big old blood spatter. Cabinet. Nothing. Nice. Duct tape, scrap electronics. I'm really not going to get any of that stuff yet. Hmm. What's this book? Small scorched book. Beer. This almost looked like a kid's room, but maybe not if there's like a beer. Hello? Got a box of detergent. Um, here we go. Hey, EDE. Can you take this stuff from me, please? How about this, uh, we haven't looked at this service rifle yet. Seems pretty nice. Oh, it's like an M16, or at least by the picture. Damn. Um, well, geez. Damage 48. That's actually more valuable. I'm gonna put the service rifle on EDE for now. I might even sell it. Who knows? Caravan lunch. Get rid of that. And then the maze as well. Delicious. Programmers Digest. Psycho Radix right away. Alright. We are good to go for now, I'd say. Thank you, darling. Darling. Hello. Ooh. That looks very atmospheric. Man, I bet this game looks amazing with, uh, graphical enhancement mods. If it looks this good. This game came out in, what, 2010? It's not bad. You know? Was that helping our limbs, by the way? Any chance? Condition? Nope. I wouldn't expect it to. Last time I ate some corn, it didn't exactly help out my broken arm. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. That's it for now. Oh, looks like sun's going down. Maybe we'll stay the night here in Nipton. What do you guys think? Looks like we got some sort of house way off in the distance here. I'm still on the lookout for traps. This is quite the, uh, large town. Anything cool around back here, maybe? Got like a, a water spigot of some kind. Ugh. Water valve. Nasty. Can I climb up this thing? Get a nice view? Oh, don't think so. Alright, well, back around this way, I guess. I have a sneaking suspicion that this little house right here has something for us. Look at them smoke plumes. That music is very unnerving, isn't it? Let's see. Hello. Oof. These NCR. Say Nipton Hotel. This must be the uh, whorehouse that we found ourselves in. Yep. Here, NCR dog tag. I have a feeling that um, the NCR would pay us well for that kind of thing. What do you think? NCR mantle armor. Um, I suppose we can use that as a disguise, right? Probably. Let's see. You are now dressed as a member of the NCR. How about that? Oh, it's even better than what we got, I think. Well, maybe. Medium. Um, oh, it gives me carry weight. It is dangerous to wear, though. Um, I don't know. Depending. Well, I think that greater protection might be worth it right now. So, let's actually get our, uh, our metal armor out of the, uh, out of EDE. I wonder where she keeps all that stuff, right? So, I'm going to collect all of the, uh, armor that they have and just repair, um, the stuff. So, you can get a dog tag and the armor and a dog tag face wrap armor, huh? Looks like you guys, uh, got caught unawares, we'll say. Apparel. Um, let's see, plus five. They're all the same. Maintain. Uh, which looks the coolest? Face wrap armor, probably. Boom, baby! Jury rigger. Okay. Say hello. Anyone here? Oh, maybe this is like just the NCR outpost here in uh, in Nipton? 
Some desk. Got some bottle caps. That's pretty good. Not terrible anyway. Empty filing cabinets. I wish the walk speed was a little bit higher. Open cash register. Nice easy lock. Oop. Boom, baby. All right. Low tech hacking. Reminds me, I just watched a, uh, a video the other day. You guys might have seen it on Reddit. Um, where this one guy purchased a $100 lock and figures out how to crack it in like 30 seconds. Let's see here. I guess that's it for here. What is that on the wall? It's just a lamp. Door to Nipton. This was the Nipton Hotel. It was. I guess these were the hotel buildings. Because, oh. That was spooky. Uh-oh. Something marked red. I don't know how it's far away, though. Anything cool? It's like, were these uh, buildings burned down before the Legion got here or afterwards? Gotta be careful, though. I don't want to step on any more landmines, that's for sure. How about this building? Oh, also, honey. Please, take this off my, uh, off my hands. Um... There we go. Face wrap armor. Thank you. Oop. Whoa, excuse me. I guess I'm not jumping over that. Got anything cool in this mailbox? Sunset sarsaparilla. I'll drink that right now. Why not? I could use a nice soda myself. I think I'll have one after this. I drink a lot of Diet Coke. It's probably not the best for me, but I don't know. It's not the worst either. I know everyone always likes to say that, uh, what's it called? Aspartame is so terrible, right? Well, I'll have you know that it's really not that bad. At least, it's one of the most researched substances by the FDA because of the quote-unquote aspartame hoax in the 90s? Late 80s? 90s? It said that uh, aspartame was really bad for you? Or at least that was the fear. Um, somehow, that's the uh, kind of story that got propagated. Um, but that does not seem to be the case. At least I hope so, because... Or hope not. It's like I said, I drink a, a fair amount of Diet Coke. Empty whiskey bottle. Nothing all that great. Um, grilled mantis. Delicious. Um, HP plus one. Sure, I'll eat that. I'll eat it right now. Why not? Or I'll save it for later. I don't want to overstuff myself, right? Excuse me, Edie. I wish that she didn't have collision on her. Um, makes it kind of a pain in the butt to walk around. Alright, we're getting there. A hop. Uh, ugh. Platforming in this game. Not quite there, I would say. Okay, Nipton General Store. Here's where I have high hopes. Oh, we got a living person here who might not be in the best state in retrospect. Oh, you guys see that? What was that? Oh, it's a Nuka Cola sign. Jesus, scared me. Um, hey, guy. You okay? Are you fucking kidding me? First I get my leg smashed, and then in walks the Powder Ganger's grim fucking reaper. What the fuck have you got against us, man? Oh, man. Jesus fucking Christ. If you want me dead, just give me 15 medics and I'll fucking OD for you, okay? I'm sorry. Fuck. Was that a reference to the fact that the Powder Gangers hate me? Oh, he is a Powder Ganger. So he knows, he's, I'm the guy, oh my god, that's so cool that he responded to our faction, uh, relation. Why are you still here? I don't know, I just love it here. <laughs> what the fuck do you think, asshole? I like this guy. Surprise, the second place was I got to live, but they beat my fucking legs with hammers. I'm fucking crippled, get it? Jesus, um, I can spare some medics, I guess. Oh wait, medics. Then you're a fucking dream come true, ain't you? How much you gonna give me? Um, I don't want to give him one dose. Big fucking deal. Hand it over. Thanks. Would be nice. How did you survive? What happened in this town? See you later. Bye. Bye. Sorry, boxcars. Um, I wish I had better news for you. Let's see here. Man, he even, like, knew me by my face. I guess. Got anything cool? Oh, Jesus, sorry. Oh. Jeez, I scared myself. Anything, any cash right up? Oh, it's empty. Oh, there's a magazine. Nice. Um, Salesman Weekly, huh? 
Ooh. I feel like I always defer to these, uh, oof, these, um, kind of support skills like lock picking and science because I hate being told no. I hate finding a place with like loot and stuff and not being able to get it. Let's see what we got up here. Now, was everything this shitty like before? That's what I'm saying. It kind of just looks like, like, this is a lot of damage for the Legion to have done or even to have cared to inflict, you know what I mean? Maybe these people were just really sloppy. What's that? Millsurp review, huh? Got some magazines, an oven, a pilot light. That's pretty nice. But I could make a burner out of that or something. What do we got here? Medical clipboard. Oh, maybe that meant there was a doctor here. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Oh, we got a safe. We got a harmonica. That's pretty cool. Hmm. What else we got? Open safe? Oh, it's unlocked. Oh, shit. We'll take that. And I'll take the bottle cap and this stuff right here. Dirty water, I suppose, is nice to have. Uh, Nuka-Cola, pre-war money, sunset, sarsaparilla. Nothing amazing, but not a bad haul. What about in here? Oh, a bathroom, huh? Anything cool? Hey, that's actual water. Look at that. All radiated, of course, but what isn't these days? You know what I'm saying? I... All right, well, shit. I guess that's everything. Nipton. The gift that keeps on giving. Well, to me, anyway. Not to the uh, residents, I suppose. Atmospheric. All right, bud. Well, I'll see you later. Um, wish I could do more for you, but I'm not gonna. So... Let's see, we got across the... How many fucking houses are in this place? We got one. We got... Let's check around this side. Like a couple trailers over there. Um... What about on this side? Doesn't look like much else over there. Or maybe I can see something over there. It's quite a lot, to be honest. I have very many shotgun shells left. I'll have to be careful there, especially not if I'm uh, spooking myself by shooting. Ooh. I think we're good. Vacuum cleaner. And uh, an ashtray. It's really cool how they put little things for you to find in all these different houses and stuff, like that magazine on, on the floor. Um, I imagine a lot of players would just walk right past that. I know I miss a lot of stuff too. Um, but it's cool when there's like little hand-placed stuff like that, right? Oh, see like this, open briefcase, a Braxo cleaner. I mean, I suppose that would be cool if I needed an Abraxo cleaner. Um, I remember that being one of my favorite things about Morrowind back when I played. Was that a magazine by chance? Nope, chessboard. A bottle cap, though. Oh, a star bottle cap. See? That's what I'm talking about. That's, like, exactly what I'm saying. Um, I remember thinking that that was very cool um, in Morrowind, how you could find these unique items in these difficult-to-reach places. Um, ooh, purified water. Hey. Box of detergent, Abraxo cleaner. Got all kinds of stuff in here. Jake juice, huh? From a Nuka Scotch whiskey. Atomic cocktail, Jesus. Sleep, oh my god. Well, we can take that. I don't think we'll need to uh, sleep after all. What do you guys think? Though I don't really like doing stuff by night, if I'm being honest. Excuse me, darling. I'd say it's good for now. What do you think? Let's go and check out these. Trailers. Man, this is crazy. It's like, it's been what? three episodes that we've been in this town? Activate can- Oh, I can turn it on, huh? Made at- Oh, I can cook stuff. Here you go. Um, oh, it's survival skill. Gotcha. Makes sense to me. Fire ant steak. I understand. So, the skills do affect a lot more than just what they say on the, uh, the skill menu. That's good to keep in mind, I'd say. Got some bottle caps that I see? Yes, sir. Take coffee pot. Anything cool in here? No traps of any kind? Bent tin can. Carton of cigarettes. Jesus. Kind of a grim scene. Um, let's check this over here. Hello, my love. Oh, I have a radio. I totally forgot about that. 
Oh, this is the drive through This is like DLC, right? I think I'm going to hold off on that. Um, ugh, that's creepy. That is kind of a weird thing, right? Where you know like a certain area is uh, related to DLC and you don't want to do the DLC yet, so you just kind of bugger off. That's like what I did with um, that sequence break that I mentioned um, a few episodes ago in Fallout 3 where I accidentally discovered Dad before you were kind of supposed to. And I felt... I, I knew what I had found. Um, and I had a feeling that it was going to make me skip over a bunch of the stuff in um, DC, right? And I didn't want to do that because I wanted to experience all the content and get all the experience and whatnot. Um, so I just kind of slowly walked out of Dad's little room there underneath that whatever it was, um, car auto shop, and then went to DC, did everything the way I was supposed to, and then headed back and found dear old Dad. And I think this is the last trailer for us to check, right? Oof. Excuse me, look at these scorpions. You guys normally just have scorpions lying around here? Oof, who's this man? Is that a laser rifle? It is. Wastelander. Well, maybe you got the chance to put up a fight at least. Seems better than the way the Legion did everyone. Oh, this is kind of a fun story. Not really a story even. More purified water, huh? Um, I was, I'm watching The Wire with Liz for the first time, and we're on season two. Um, and uh, there's a doctor, like an autopsy doctor, uh, his voice was so familiar. I was listening to it, and I was like, I know I know that from somewhere. And it popped into my head. It was Three Dog. Or at least I thought it was, and then I checked IMDb. And sure enough, it was him. It's hard to listen to someone like Three Dog for so long without getting his uh, particular... Well, the particulars of his voice, we'll say, ingrained in your head. Oh. The brain's funny like that, isn't it? I feel like, um... Just the way it's able to recognize stuff and categorize stuff. It's pretty impressive. The human brain toy car. Oh, don't tell me this is like an actual child's bedroom and that there's blood all over everything. That's a bit much. That's the world we live in, right? Welcome to the Mojave. Anything cool on the shelves? Pack of cigarettes? Alright, maybe this wasn't a kid's room. Maybe, who even knows? Maybe that toy car was there from the, uh, from before the war. That's what I'll tell myself anyway. Box of detergent. Nothing all that great. Anything cool? What is this? Bent tin cans? Saving it for something. This place kind of sucks a little bit. Honey mesquite pod. That'd be nice. If we needed it. Don't at the moment. Excuse me, darling. Always getting in my way. Alright. Fuck it. Um, well, I'd say that about does it for Nipton. What do you guys think? So at this point... Um, I suppose we're just going to head east around to Novak. I, uh, that was the original plan, if I do recall correctly. Look at this. It's kind of cool. Um, it's possible that I missed something else in here, but to be frank, I think three episodes of looting is enough for you guys, I'm sure. Um, and it's looking to be... Oh, we got a little bit of time. Got like a minute and a half, so why don't we just see how far east we can get in a minute and a half. See some popping in. Nice to be back on the road again, too. Let's go ahead and take that atomic cola. Um, because I don't want to sleep. Nine rads per second. That sure is atomic. And now I'm going to switch over to this here scoped cowboy repeater. I think that's one of my longest range weapons at the moment. And we are going the right direction, right? Let's see here. Stats. Items. Data. That's what I'm looking for. All right. We're going to Novak. There we go correctional facility, so I guess we're just going to go up this way. This must be the river going into the Hoover Dam. Yeah, right about there. Ah, oh, this world is not overly huge, is it? Oh, I don't know. There's actually a fair bit of stuff to do. Crimson Caravan, West Side, South Entrance, Northern Passage, Camp McCarran. That's obviously Vegas. I remember being um, slightly underwhelmed by the size of Vegas the first time I played. Um, I suppose... That that's the typical Bethesda engine game scale problem. Um, and I guess Fallout has more of an excuse than other games since it is post-apocalyptic. But you could tell that the place was not even large before the war. So that excuse doesn't really fly. Um, ooh. Sunset Sarsaparilla. What is it? Oh. Hey! Open the... Did you see that? 
It's like there was a... A... What's it called? Star cap underneath that. And I think I just threw it somewhere. There it is. Weird. Um, anyway, we'll keep uh, heading east and I guess north at this point. But, oh, to finish off my thought. I was going to say that I wonder if there's any mods that kind of add to the scale of New Vegas. I wouldn't be surprised. Who knows? If you know, let me know in the comments below. And I promise I will read it. Um, as always, thank you guys very much for joining me. And in the next episode, we will head up north and see what awaits us there.